What's going on, ladies and gentlemen? My name is Tenor, and we are back here on the Survival Series server. This is episode 9, and when I last left you guys, I was working on this iron farm here. Uh, turns out that my iron farm was one block too high. I needed to have another block here, so I've done that. And if we come down here, ignore the, the zombie villager sounds. We've got some iron here and some poppies because the farm's working. I only needed to put 10 villagers in. Um, I've, I've got all 10 of them over on this side, which kind of scares me, kind of freaks me out, but that's fine. I can always move some more into that side later when I get some space around here. Um, in addition... After I finished doing this, I know I said I was going to try and stream this week. Things didn't happen. But I did start the sandbar right here. And if you look here, I'm going to extend this all the way across that way. I actually ran out of sand. I had it all in my inventory. I've been taking it from over there. And I'm going to just extend it out this way. Now this whole little island right here, I'm going to take that all the way back. So all of these, this stuff will go away. But we've got this this right here. I'm going to bring this curve around and just... Actually, I, I, don't, I don't know if I like this specific curve just yet. Um, I'll probably shallow it out just a little bit. I don't know. I, it's, it's a work in progress. I think this is actually too short of a, of a sandbar. But at the same time, I, I want to make sure that it's, you know usable because there's no reason for a sandbar to be all the way across and big ships can't get in it's only to break up the the wind or the the waves so once i get those down over there in fact let's go over there real quick eat some food so if we come over here this is going to stay here boats will go across so we should have plenty of room for the boats to come in around the bend and then dock themselves over in this area right here. So we'll make the docks over on this side. We'll have a couple of docks. Maybe some tugs will go over on this side. Put a fishing pier, something like that. I don't know. Something something fun to make this side of the island look as good as the other side or the, the center of the island is going to look. Because this is a long-term project. I hope to have access to this server for a very long time. And if I don't, well, I'll just grab the world and continue it on my own. But that shouldn't be a problem. I'm sure we should be good. So I'm going to start collecting some more of this sand to get, the, get that sandbar started. And I think that's what we're going to work on today. We're going to try and get that sandbar put together at least... Uh, at least so that it looks about where I want it to be. So let me go ahead and get all this sand mined up and I will be right back with you guys. And we're back. So I had to actually shut down for a little bit because there was a nice big thunderstorm that rolled through my area. And I honestly don't remember where I was at. Let me go back over here. So I was working on... I, I think I was. I needed more sand is what I was doing. I was over here working on this sandbar. I believe I've got most of it done. I might actually extend it out another five or six blocks that way. Everything over here looks good. I need to take out... Yeah, yeah, so I need more sandstone because what I'm doing is I'm just hollowing it out. Just to show you guys. I'm just putting this layer on top because trying to fill in this whole area is just ridiculous. And I still have to make the outside, um, the outside grating. So that's where we're at right now. I need to get more materials. I need to find myself a nice desert, a nice mesa, something like that to get the rest of this stuff. I'm gonna start taking this down at some point, but that's where we're at with the sandbar. I still need to take all of that out, which that shouldn't be that bad of a, of a process. And the reason that this has stayed, and actually let me uh, clear that up right there. 
and place that there. Yeah, that looks right. I plan on putting a lighthouse around here somewhere just to just to you know recognize where the sandbar is and then this whole thing will be built up and it'll have lights on it and whatnot just as further notice of course and yeah so you know let's go double check our process or progress i should say on the iron farm i thought i saw a squid there yep get out of here squid Four. I saw I cleared it up earlier. I just didn't. I don't remember how far before I cleared it up. And I actually want to take a second here and let's uh, eat real quick first. You know, make sure I'm full up on health before I start. Oops. That would have been bad. Oh. Oh wow. Why can I see down there? Is there light down there? Interesting. I I, I think I'm gonna Geronimo this. Let's 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 go for it. Wow, that was loud. I'll just let him blow that up. That's weird why there's light down here. Unless it's all from the, the lava. Do I even have torches? Yes, I do. Let's light this area up. just to make sure we don't get any more mobs over here. At least in this area. Let's come up here and check. It's getting to be a little bit of an exploration too. Oh, do we have any wood on us? Yes, we do. I don't know if I want to use that wood though, but I, I probably will just to make sure. Let's uh, switch pickaxes get some of this right here there are all the zombies oops ah here they come I think it'd be amazing oh, am I already out I'm out <laughs> I was gonna torch it up a little more how about you guys just die from that? Will that, will that, no? Ugh. That's fine. All right, let's make some torches real quick. Uh, we, we're not going to make a bunch of them, just enough. Because I want to light this area up a bit and kind of prevent some of the spawns over here. Let's come up this way. Good, that's the end of this side. Let's come down here and light this area up. Well, I was kind of hoping coming down here that there would be a spawner, but it doesn't look like it's going to happen for me. I'd really like an XP farm somewhere, and I just haven't had the luck yet of having that. Let's check our armor real quick. That's all good. I need to make some diamond gear still. Ow. <laughs> uh, let's come up here. Oh, this is just more area. That's all. Okay. And now I gotta figure out where I came from. There it is. Nothing big.
Awesome. Okay, so we've got we've got iron coming in at random intervals. As long as I stay in the area, they'll spawn. Um, I I probably need to put more villagers in here just to make them spawn quicker. But this is not a multiple village farm. I know Tango's got that really super awesome design, but I don't need that much iron. I need a little bit of iron, but I don't need all of that iron. So. Uh, back to this, we're going to build up a, a lighthouse right here. I don't know if the lighthouse is going to project light, if it's going to just stand here. I don't know yet. It'll probably do something weird. And then I need to fill in all of this, and get this all finished up, clean this up, and then we will work on the docks. And actually, well, that's I think that's what we'll do right now. We'll start working on the dock area and trying to figure out positioning of the boats. Now the boats wouldn't be right against the sandbar. Uh, there might be a dock next to the sandbar and then a boat and then a boat and a dock. So that might make the most sense for what we're doing. Um, I gotta figure out what type of plank I want to use though. There's so many different planks and in fact there's so many just right here that we could use. That's uh, not funny. Let's take down this oak and do some testing real quick. just thought of a really good idea of what I can do for that thing right there to make it you know kind of on theme and I think I'm gonna make a gantry I'm just gonna make that a nice little crane that just sits over there and unloads things maybe you know a fish cannery type deal maybe I'll put a put something over there I don't know Something's going to go over there on top of that thing, or I'm going to have to move it from that spot. I really, I really like the idea of it being submerged into the water because it's it's nice. And then of course I'll have the one above for the extra iron. But uh, this is where I'm at right now. The spacing might need some work. I might go six apart instead of four. Uh, I have these right here because for some reason you can't get out of the out of the water as easily if you're up a block and a half you might be able to but yeah I'll take them out why not um, as long as I can get up here it doesn't really matter so 
I, I'm not sold on the two, the two wide yet. I might actually go three wide if I can place bottom slabs properly. <laughs> I think I like the three wide idea, especially for the plank, uh, the uh, docks over there. They're going to have to be at least five wide. This is a single side since the the sandbar is right there. We're not going to have it butt up against the against the dock because the dock is supposed to be a free floating device, and if it's right up against the the setup, it's it's not really free floating. So that's where we're at on the dock idea. I'm going to mock them out a little more later and finish them up. So that is actually going to do it for today's episode. I hope you guys have enjoyed the episode. And if you did, hit that like button. If you want to see more, hit the subscribe button. And next time we're going to go work on a mob drop because if you watch my Peercraft series, you'll see one going to be placed into effect on there and we're just going to copy that design basically and bring it over here so it'll be fun but i won't bore you with the details hope you get to see the peercraft episode and i will see you guys in the next one